So, yeah. <laughs> that was my fault. I did not see the other heart over there, and I was running around here for quite a while, restarting the uh, uh, save point and all that. Just trying to see where all of these were. And it turned out that I had no need to do that. Yeah, there was no need to do that because they were obviously right there and I just had to go and get them. But I was being dumb. So anyway... Yeah, we're very close to the end. This level anyway. Look at at least the sinew. The sinew looking like spider webs. It's all... Well. Very gross. Oh. Ew. Hear that sound? The door opening? That's duh. It is, that is totally duh. I'm, I'm stuck. Okay. Go. Ugh. Look at that tongue just like writhing out. The cat sneezed. It's very cute. Okay. I think that's the queen. I'm gonna shoot her. No, oh, uh, let's try this. Oh. Now you're gonna see uh, who the queen really is. Oh, so I'm, I can't run anymore. I'm just walking slowly up to her. It's not allowing me to run or do anything else. Okay. Cutscenes. They're nice. I like them. I was expecting someone else. You don't know your own mind. It's nearly a complete stranger. What you claim not to know is merely what you've denied. You've recaptured your vagrant memories. What are you doing with them? You once rejected my attempts to control our lives forcefully. But now you've allowed another to succeed in my role. I won't miss your tentacles. You would prefer the hot, stinking breath and unyielding attention of a potent, unreasoning, unfeeling Hellraiser? I don't think so. Can you give me more than a warning? Caterpillar said you might help. I'd need a better reason to respond than what's currently on offer. If you don't, we're all doomed. Not doomed. Forgotten. I may survive here, but you're finished. You see the pattern of destruction? I know you do. The train is trying to destroy all evidence of your past, and especially the fire. Now, who would want that? Who benefits from your madness? The destruction of Wonderland is the destruction of me. Indeed, and vice versa. I've set it in motion. I can derail it. This is good for me. I'm not insane. I didn't kill my family. I am fine. I'm not mad. I'm innocent. I, I mean, not guilty. What's happening? What are you doing? The train must be stopped. But there's more to do. Your view conceals a tragedy. The whole truth you claim to see eludes you because you won't look at what's around you. There is no method in this madness. My professional opinion, madness is often a treatable disease, though perhaps not in this case. Authority must be obeyed, or it must be overthrown. Cruel to be kind, that's my technique, as they say. But she's as mad as a hat on poor dearie. Worst is over, and over, and over. Forget it, Alice. Forget it. Can't distinguish reality from illusion. Remember your last journey? An elephant never forgets where she left her trunk when traveling by train of a lease. Never bigger than your head. I may be wrong, Your Grace, but I doubt it. Down this path of primordial ooze and sideways. Indeed, Doctor, we'll 
demanded, I'm sure. I mean to say, it's very hot in here. I mean to say, fuzzy. And she's no helping. Oh, no! No help at all! Humiliation, I say. I approve your release, and back you come like a bad penny. Reputation in ruins, people talk, Alice. I'm an old dog. Ready to bow, don't you know? Loyalty. You must never run away from home. Stay, Alice. Sit! Okay. So... Despite what's happening right now, I'm going to discuss what just happened with the Queen. Um, let me move my mic. So, the Queen is basically, that's Alice when she was young. That's what she looked like with her short hair and her face and like that. Uh, so that is young Alice, actually. That's what she represents, mostly, in that case. Um, technically, that's also kind of her depower depowered form, because she was a lot stronger, used to be anyway. Um... So now, I don't know, I, I don't think this is real, I think this is another hallucination. But I could be, I'm not entirely certain of it. But this is one of the creepier sections of the game because, as of course, we can't really run. I mean, this is about as fast as we go. Can't do anything that powerful that the badass Alice can do. Um, we can ski. Sort of, let me, let me ski. Nee 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 nee. Kind of ski. So, um, can't jump, so we basically just have to waddle through this whole but whole bit. It's a pretty terrifying bit too, I gotta say. I don't think there's anything this way. Yeah, it looks like the o it looks like you know the older Alice, and perhaps she has been sent back to the asylum. I'm not sure though. Oh, the camera. Oh, I could fix the camera. I didn't think I could. He's just staring at a wall. That's, nice. That's a pretty wall. Stark in there. Oh, that that's probably not a hallucination. This might just be her memories back at the asylum, because that was Tweedledee and Tweedledee. They're cousins that look exactly the same, but basically Tweedledee and Tweedledum is who they are. Basically, and yeah, that's not the right way. Lots of blood. And they uh, tortured her. Tweedledee and Tweedledum tortured her horribly when she was here at the asylum, although she wasn't really able to move. She was catatonic at the time, but they just tortured her horribly. If it isn't what's her name from the idiot's ward. Yeah, it's Alex, Uncle's prize lunatic. The instruments are gruesome, but a hole in the head gives the troubles more space. Just the thing for your stone of madness. Good for seizures too, maybe. You must be as sick of those as I am hearing you whinge about them. Trepanning. Oh god. And uh, that lady was kind of like their, I don't know, aunt or whatever, who was kind of in charge of them. Um, I believe that they were, or I don't know, she was someone who was in charge of their whole situation. And um, the Tweedledee and Tweedledum are related to the guy who owns this place. Uh, not Rutledge himself, or maybe it was Rutledge. Oh, that actually looks like a character from, um, well, actually, not really, because technically all of the insane kids from the first game were all male, for, for some reason. Maybe they just didn't have female models. Some mental conditions are relieved by bloodletting. 
doctor thinks it won't be effective against your symptoms. But I am at the end of my tether, and these leeches need the work. A baker's dozen, nurse. Let me put them on her. No, me, me. I can make them hurt. Of course, uh, leech leeches were um, actually were given to her as a punishment at one point after she attacked Nurse D, um, who she called the Duchess. And currently, uh, well, at the time in Wonderland, she was fighting her, fighting the Duchess. And uh, she turned on a nurse and fought against her. I think she tried to. Oh. Oh. Anyway, she turned on the nurse, calling her Duchess, and tried to, uh, I don't know, beat the crap out of her, hit her with a spoon, or I don't know, but, uh, yeah, hurt, hurt, hurt her really bad and called her Duchess, and as a punishment, she was forced to do leeches, or, not, leech, she was, um, given leeches and stuff, and, um, and it's funny that right after that in the game, right after the Duchess battle, you have to go through this area that has a whole bunch of leech-like creatures in him, and fight them. Interesting. Also, I believe that uh, she fought back against Tweedledee and Tweedledum. I keep calling them that. That's not their na names in the real world, but I'm going to keep calling them that. She fought back against them, attacking one of them with a spoon and giving him a pretty bad scar. With a d goddamn spoon. She's a little kid, mind you. She's a little kid, and she's still this strong, doing this stuff. Even though for most of her, most of that time she's catatonic, she shouldn't be that strong. But somehow she's just that strong and is able to overpower her guards whenever she, f when she does get her mind together to work on that, she can. I know which way's up and which way's down. I was gonna say. No prayers. Don't interrupt. If I can't. Go to the laboratory. Maddening. Yes, you are. But what am I? I'll give you. A present. You shouldn't. I have nothing for you. Okay, that's the real world versions. And that's the Wonderland versions. Felix Felix. What? Where? Is the fox among the pigeons? Sly devil. Moved out of the hen house then. What what? Come now, Alice. Am I not to be as much honored and obeyed as the Queen? Is that asking too much? I want what she wanted. Give yourself over to that. Trade the tentacles for the train. It's altogether a better ride. It's that, or back to Rutledge. Never a kind word or reward for services rendered. Don't I deserve a bit of luck? Don't piss on what's right no one to me, I say brought you out of the asylum. Now you go back on your own accord. I told you, Mother dear, you're a distant and stubborn child, too content in her own world. Young women need to leave their wonderlands. The real world is not so wonderful. You'll need to grow up. Perhaps some more time in care? You look decent enough, but appearances deceive. I know you're for an unstable and violent person. I can't say I'm surprised you've been incarcerated in the asylum again. A long stay under supervision would serve you right. Maybe she has returned, and now she's trying to escape. I thought this was a hallucination, but... Like I say, I, I don't know if this is a hallucination. Oh, whoop, 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 okay. I'm not sure if this is a, a hallucination or not. Hi. Yeah? Yeah, what? Okay. You just keep on keeping on. Just keep on keeping on. Oh, hi there. You can't see. That's a wall. Okay, just so you know, that's a wall right there. Don't walk in. Hi. You again. How you doing? Whoops. Ooh. 
Oh, we're about to meet another, another character that I haven't talked about very much. Oh, it's all dizzy. Okay, stay yeah, stay in the light, basically it's what you're supposed to do. Stay go towards the light. I didn't talk about this character because I didn't I missed her. She was uh the little girl uh in the Veil of Tears that we would see later on. I I didn't even I didn't know about her then. I would see her but I didn't realize her importance. I'll talk to, talk about her afterwards. Help, Alice! We need your help! Don't desert us! Again, don't ignore us! Why do you suffer? The Queen's tyranny is just a memory. She has no power over you, does she? Our enemies come and go, but now a new evil reigns, and this fiend's malevolence has eclipsed the conquered Queen's. This is one of the insane children. Um, in the first game, most of them were male, but I'm pretty sure that they were just—they just didn't have any female child, female models or whatever to use for them. Um, she was a little girl who actually drew a lot of the stuff uh, up for, from here. Cheshire Cat drew some too, but the invisible platforms and signs and stuff, she drew some of it. Cheshire Cat drew some of it, and my cat wants out. So hold on.